Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today I got a tag for you. Um, this one is the new Beauty Guru tag. Everybody's done this, I'm sure, in the past, and I just saw it online, and I thought, I, you know, I'd go ahead and do it since I'm new to the community, just a couple of weeks. So I want to go ahead and uh, answer these questions. There were some cute questions in here, and there's only uh, 11 of them, so this shouldn't take too long. Um, let's go ahead and get started. What is your favorite makeup product? Lip. Anything to do with lips. Lipstick, lip gloss, I, I, lip balms, I'm a fan of. I mean, eyeshadows are really, really close second. But anything to do with lips, that's that's my favorite. What is the reason for starting your YouTube channel? Uh, the two main reasons was, on the non-beauty related end, was um, to talk about my mental illnesses like my bipolar PTSD, OCD, and anxiety and all that. And also on the other end of the makeup end was I'm, you know, I'm 42, so I wanted to talk about makeup for more mature women in skincare and, you know, how the makeup trends, you know, should we do them? How would they look on us? I mean, there's no rules to makeup. I, I put up on enough highlighter to signal the aliens, okay? Up in outer space. <laughs> yeah, I do what I want. I don't care, you know. I always have fun with my makeup. I have understated days, but most days I'm, I'm a pal, you know. I have neutral days. Today's kind of neutral, but I love bright colors. You'll see me in bright blue, teal, green. I mean, I'm a bright eyeshadow and lip kind of person. What beauty guru inspired you to make your channel? Um, there was a couple. One of the more popular ones, and the reason I pick, I'm picking her is I really respect her. I respect her opinion. She's a sweetheart, and that's Emily Noel 83. She's just so sweet, down to earth. In her opinion, she's always truthful. She tells you like it is, if you're gonna like it or not. You know, I just, I love the way she does her channel and how, you know, just how nice she is and everything. So she really inspired me. And also Nikki Murphy inspired me. She, she gave me the push to go ahead and do this because I see how much fun she has with her channel. I mean, she has her ups and downs with it, sure, she has lately. But she has so much fun and gets so much enjoyment out of doing YouTube and, you know, talking to all of us and, you know, doing stuff like that. And I'm already enjoying it. I, I mean, I'm loving it when I even, you know, I haven't been feeling well lately with kidney stones and then my anxiety and PTSD. This is the one thing that's kind of keeping my mood up. You know, it gives me the drive to get up and put some makeup on, have fun playing with makeup and you sit in front of camera and talk to y'all. So those are really the two that have inspired me to uh, start my channel, and I really thank Nikki for, uh, you know, supporting me and giving me advice when I needed it. And you know, girl, I'm probably gonna be calling on you more for some more advice. <laughs> okay, favorite thing to do besides beauty-related things? Um, reading. I'm a big re reader. I mean, big, and I love movies also. Um. Let's see, what else do I like to do? I mean, we have our cats that we like to rescue and take care of them. But other than that, uh, reading is my main thing. I can read a book in a day, a two, three, two to three hundred page book in a day, if you don't bother me. Um, but yeah, I'm a big, avid reader. Favorite store to shop at? <sighs> Most people will say Sephora or Ulta. And some people say Mac. I'm gonna go for all around, all, you know, Ulta would be the best for that, for all around, you know, because you got your drugstore and your high end, but honestly, I love to shop at MAC. That's my favorite makeup place to shop at. The girls up there take such great care of me. We laugh, we, we have fun, you know, and doing makeovers and stuff. I just, I just love going to my MAC up here. I really do enjoy, enjoy it there. Okay. What is your favorite go-to perfume? I don't have it, so I can't show you because I'm out. Just ran out a couple months ago. I already threw it away. I will show you the bottle. It's Calvin Klein Euphoria. Sorry, my cat is hitting the tripod. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Bad boy. Um, it's in a purple, weird, weird-shaped bottle. Um, but I used to uh, work at Dillard's at the perfume counter, and I made friends with the Calvin Klein rep. I love almost all Calvin Klein perfumes, actually. My other favorite's Obsession, but, um, 
euphoria is just it's like I got like orchid in it and it's just real the best way to describe it is sultry it's a sexy and sultry scent I mean I just oh, I love it I need to get another one even if it's just a little bitty rollerball I gotta get one okay what is your favorite color <laughs> my favorite color hmm well mine is, <laughs> my favorite color honestly is this right here bright green yes I, I even have a notepad in bright green a lot of stuff you saw one of my bins is bright green i have shirts that are bright i mean i have so much stuff that's bright green i have tons of bright green makeup tons of bright green nail polish even if i have a similar shade nail polish or eyeshadow i'll still buy another bright green one because i love it so much and i do like other shades of green but bright green is my favorite let's see flower or bow on flower or bow i don't know if they mean hair or your nails either way it's going to be flower because I never was into bows and I I mean y'all saw in my nail polish declutter I have a little thing full of little uh, flower decals for my nails so I love flowers I love putting those on my nails but um yeah it had to be flower for but if it's uh, nails or hair either way and excuse the way my hair looks today I had to put it in a clip because it was flyaway central I don't know what's going on outside today it was static electricity everywhere so I had to throw it up in this little whatever this is <laughs> i haven't decided what it is yet <laughs> uh rings or bracelets well i like both i mean i only got one bracelet on right now this is my bracelet that my neighbor got me a few years ago for christmas it has my name on it um with purple beads and silver beads on it and you know i'm always wearing rings wedding ring and i always have other rings on uh, probably rings i like rings a little bit more than bracelets i'd have to say yeah, if it come down to it, it'd have, it'd have to be rings. I can't live without my rings. And let's see. Favorite drugstore makeup brand. If we're going with how much I have of it, it'd be Maybelline. I noticed that I, when I'm, since I've been doing my declutter, I have a ton of Maybelline stuff. They got some good stuff. Like I got every one of their palettes. Um, some are good, some are near. Um, yeah. It's a toss-up between Maybelline and CoverGirl. I've got some CoverGirl stuff that I really, really like. Some of their foundations and their eyeliners. Yeah, it's a, it's a toss-up between Maybelline and CoverGirl. Probably Maybelline edges them out a little bit. But I'd say Maybelline probably most likely. And also, something that makes you smile. That's the last question. Something that makes me smile is my cats. My cats always make me smile. Like my <laughs> My cat bear just hit the tripod. That made me laugh and chuckle. They always make me smile. They do goofy stuff. I mean, yesterday, I don't know if y'all saw my Instagram, our cat Tiger, we had got some donuts and it was empty and it was sitting on the island. He was sleeping in it. The cat weighs like 15 pounds and he's sleeping in this donut box. It's hilarious. Just look at my Instagram. You can get this big tiger looking, his name's Tiger, but he's a tiger striped cat sitting in the bo donut box. It's hilarious. <laughs> But yeah, my cats make me smile, and my husband. My husband always makes me smile, at least, especially when I'm feeling down. You know, he always has some smart-ass snarky comment for me, so. But um, that's it for the tag. I'm going to film a few more videos, and I will see y'all later.